And everybody, my name is Kedron, welcome back for another video of... I am your president, the prologue. Continuing right here, this might be the last time we play the prologue, I don't know, boys. We'll see how it goes. I'm just hoping, because last video we tried to go with it, the normal route, and we ended up not getting re-elected once again. It's really hard to get re-elected. So I'm, I went and focused on the economy and diplomacy this time. I'm fo I'm focusing on both of those things. Really hardcore. Big time hardcore, boys. It just so happens I'm having a lot of good time with the society as well. Military is getting hurt a lot, though. Uh, so good morning, Mr. President. I'm here to tell you that today we heard uh, one of our two sports prepare to the Super Bowl, all right? Uh, people, uh, and... It's really good reviews. I told you it was worth it. All right, we should pay off during the elections. Anyway, your approval rating has increased. Nice. Exactly what I wanted, boys. That's great. I expected nothing less. There we go. Right, so since the Super Bowl is tomorrow, you have to make a final decision. Uh, yeah. About what exactly? It's really important to your image. Uh, I do not want to watch it at all. Isn't there like a third option? Uh, I've already made up my, uh, my mind. There's no other third option? I guess you could also host a bipartisan uh, Super Bowl party at the White House. What does that mean? This sounds right on. I like the other option. What does that mean exactly? It means the Democrat and the Republicans may cross parties, uh, party lines to join in rooting for their t favorite teams at the Super Bowl parties on Sunday. That sounds nice actually. Yeah, that sounds nice. So what will be your uh, final decision? All right. I prefer to watch uh, Super Bowl on TV. Uh, economy, maybe, I guess. Uh, I will go there in person. Or I will host a super um, bipartisan Super Bowl party in the White House. Let's do that. That sounds like a fun time. Boom. Bring that. Bring up big time politics. Society goes down a little bit. It's your call. I will arrange everything. Yeah. Everything on the White House. All the parties are gonna be together. Everything's gonna be. Uh, everybody's gonna be kind to me and stuff. You know, it's gonna all gonna be well. Super Bowl at the White House. American football unites the politicians. Look at that, boys. Who would have known? All right, cliffhanger must uh, make us wait. 198 days, boys. We're really getting close now. Our economy is going all the way up, which is really good. Economic crisis. Uh, it prevented the stock market to crisis. Good. Everything went up because of that. Economy went up. Society went down a little bit. New message arrived. All right, some news. We got the depressions and stuff. Mailbox. Are you good? I'm going to reply. Uh, I'm going to be positive. There we go. I'm just going to do that. Doesn't matter about this guy. Doesn't matter whatsoever. Next thing we want to do, boys. 100 military politics. We need politics to stay up there. Society, industry, I cannot... I can't sacrifice some industry. Industry doesn't matter at all, boys. Society could do that. Diplomacy. Uh, diplomacy could go up. And politics will go down. Foreign influence budget, boys. I want my diplomacy. It needs to go up. It needs to go up big time. Alright. So we absolutely need it to go up. Economy is doing pretty much fine right now. Project-wise, we... Oh, there it is. We can actually do it. Global economy scenarios. Start incorporating foreign economies into the simulation, master the numbers game. We're gonna do that, boys. We're obviously gonna do that. Uh, that's gonna bring us a more economy and more industry as well. It's really gonna help us out. Big time. Boom. Just like that. That's really gonna be uh, helpful. Next up. What do we have, buddy? Time flies, don't you think? Yeah, winter it kind of ended abruptly, whatever, last last time. It is obvious I'll be chosen to a re-election. Alright, don't be so cocky, whatever. I did unlock this option. I unlocked it, boys, so I don't need your advice. I'm highly skilled diplomat. We've provided this contract, this country with economic, economic stability. Exactly. Yes, sir, as you wish. Nonetheless, we have to prepare, uh, be prepared for the convention. Uh, statesman, America needs to be strong. Uh, diplomacy is going to go up, right? Strong as its ruler. Uh, as a family oriented, oriented man. Or businessman who is running the country. Capitalism. I think capitalism would be great. Either one of those. Statesman or capitalism. 
We are doing pretty good with the economy. I'm gonna do a statesman. Oh, that went down. Fuck. Alright, that's the wrong thing then. That's not what I wanted then. Damn. Military is not what I'm trying to focus on right now. It's bad. Alright, I want to talk to journalists. Let's do it. Hopefully I can bring up everything, boys. Uh, examinations like medical examination are afraid of uh, needles. Well, uh, I guess I'm a healthy as a horse, whatever. La same thing as last time, boys. I started doing more exercises. That's going to bring up my military. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yada, 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 boys. Let's just keep going. We're going to do the... Uh, now we're doing the, uh, the press conference. So let's do this, boys. Who wants to talk to me first? Again, you. Answer your question first. Okay. Answer your question first. What do you mean? Oh, it's bugged, boys. No, 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 game. Why is it bugged? Oh, come on, game. Answer the query question. I can't. I don't have anything. Oh, that's terrible, though. Oh, that's garbage. The game broke, boys. Why do I break every single game I play? What the fuck is going on? Now, that, w that was really important. Now, I can't be blamed for that. The game fucking glitched. Oh, unbelievable. Now, first it was Sniper Elite, now it's this? Really? The fuck is wrong, boys, with these games? They keep breaking. The convention was the perfect opportunity for me to upgrade everything. And now, because it glitched out, it fucking dest it destroyed all my chances. Unbelievable. I can it not glitch out at the worst moment? Fuck, man. All right. I appreciate that. Yeah, yeah, what's up? That was your uh, peep. That's what your people always say. All right, so I'll get to the point. Uh, global economy scenarios you spearheaded. With some decisions, global imp uh, importance we're going to have to make. All right, so after after including more localized data in our simulation, it started pre predicting a number of economic uh, uh, shifts bound to happen within the next 20 years. That's remarkable. Yeah. Indeed it is. The problem is that the simulation is also outlining things like localized economy crashes, which in proper, uh, poorer countries is tied to things like military conflict and famine. And you'd like to me, to, uh, me to tell you what to do with all this data. Yeah. Exactly. Being armed with uh, this knowledge and remaining a global superpower with we are in a position uh, where we could influence those events in, in one way or the other. Oh, really? Prepare a detailed report in time for the next G20 summit. Sounds like there is a lot to be done. That would bring up our diplomacy uh, quite a lot. Uh, still, first and foremost, we are responsible for economy. That would bring up our economy, but our diplomacy, I think, would go down. Let's do that one. Boom. Bring up big time our diplomacy skills. No worries. There we go. We're going to help out uh, the international, bo uh, internationally, boys. We're going to help out. It's, uh, it, it's, it's the right thing to do. It really is. We are focusing, after all, on these two things. On both of these things to be really high up so we can actually have a chance to be reelected, which is right now, boys. This is the time right now. Savoy Fair completed. So, new development in K Kenya require your engine uh, attention. So, uh, first off, you managed to keep your New Year's relation. Success! We did it, boys. Which means we gain 150 industry plus in industry from that. We are now 647. We're in the green for industry and we're in the green for diplomacy. We just need to be in the green for economy, boys. Just need to be in the green for that. So we're good for that. That, Tanya crisis right now. All right, just like last time, we are gonna do the same thing over here. Uh, we wanna have new deals. Because the economy is important. New deals and diplomacy. We are, we are only going to know about the, the effect of that, though, once the election is up. So the problem is, we actually have to get re-elected before getting the effect of everything. So it's very important, boys. We got to be re-elected as, re as the candid, candidate. We can't even be, like, twice I've not been chosen as the candidate. So... Uh, for my own party. So we gotta get reelected for that. Very important. We got some news right here, the new song, whatever. Mailbox, Premier Areas. 
We're gonna be Arsh once again, boys, all right? Now, we can go to development strategies. What do we wanna focus on next? Very important to uh, see what we could focus on. Our budget is kind of going low a little bit. It's in the green, but uh, we gotta be careful. So, uh, we have, economy could go all the way up. Society is gonna go down though, big time. That would be really great for economy right there. Uh, that would be unlock military uh, global domination plan, which would give us, uh, it would give us 75 politics, uh, mi minus 50 politics. <sighs> politics, I don't know what it does really for me, but uh, military wise, it's kind of risky, kind of risky a little bit, boys. I'm going to upgrade my, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to upgrade that. So friends in high places, some call it corruption, others shared entrance. Two turns for that, boys, two turns. We're gonna do that. Let us hope that we get reelected. Let's hope that I actually have a plan this time around. I'm really high up in the economy. As high as I could have been. I could have been a little bit higher, I guess. Diplomacy is all the way up, though. <clears throat> so I really did the best I could. Uh, do I have a choice? I'm ready as always. I, I'm always ready. All right. Let's go. Let's see if I'm actually gonna get reelected. Uh, questionable me, I guess, whatever. Public image, fingers crossed. All right, so, shoot. What is it? Are you gonna kick this the party you get? Yes, I did unlock it, nice. So see, you can either go, because you don't have a choice. If you do this, you don't have a plan, you're not getting reelected. You have to get either one of those two. It's the main plan, boys. This is what you gotta get. All right, so it's either you get politics and society so it's either you focus on these two right here, or you focus on this, which was economy and diplomacy. I have both of them high enough, boys. Good. So I am a, I'm, a, I'm great when it comes to international affairs, since I know quite a lot of businessmen, as well as a head of state, which makes me a perfect candidate. There it is. There it is. That sounds pretty good and shows that you're capable of being a president. You've shown many skills during the term, so I'm sure that they give, will give you time to show some more. That's right. That's the right attitude. Yeah. All right. We are about to land. I'm ready. There we go. Now we actually have a plan, which in term should make us get reelected about them time, boys. Now, who is this? We didn't have this guy last time. Why does he look like fucking Logan Paul? What is this? Don't you guys think he, he looks like Logan Paul or something? What the hell? All right. Uh, hello, Mr. President. I've pro uh, I brought you documents you've asked for. What documents? What are you talking about? Oh, the appendix from the uh, from Kenya. All right. Now we're actually seeing stuff that we've never seen before because I'm actually doing the right decisions, boys. What do you know? All right. We've managed to uh, to reach some sort of consensus. All you need to use is signatures. Would you like to take a look? Yes. Let's see it. Let's see what the letter is all about. What's the deal right here? Okay, uh, agreement between the United States and Kenya on the launch of free trade. Let's see what we, uh, if the, if it's a fair, uh, fair stuff. So it's a reject or accept boys. Let's see what we got. So point 12B, edit. Preferential US market access for Kenyan product to be enacted immediately and not in two years as initially agreed upon full list of products can be found in pedix blah 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 uh, renegotiation sessions are to take place every six months to readjust for any changes potentially happening in the dynamic canyon economy economy point Subdivised areas of development are all are to also include energy and agricultural sectors. I mean, that all sounds good to me, to be honest. It's all it sounds good to me, boys. Our economy is going to go up, right? I believe diplomacy as well. That would bring down. No, I think that would bring up our economy. Um, I'm gonna accept, to be honest. I'm gonna accept. Yeah, I'm gonna accept, boy. I'm gonna sign. 
There we go, boys. Oh my god. Oh boy. Well, let's, let's just say this is my signature right there. I did what I could, boys. That was a terrible signature, but uh, you know what it is. You just... Uh, there we go. A little bit right there. Alright, it's a terrible signature, but it's accepted. Oh, okay. Economy went up. Diplomacy went down. All good. It's all good, brother. We did it, boys. Our economy is actually in the green, which is fantastic. We're really doing good economy-wise. I didn't think... That's not my style to play economy, boys, but... Uh, you know what it is. I'll do whatever I have to do to be re-elected. So, we went further than we, were, uh, we did last time, boys. We finally managed to make it further. About that time. Mr. President, I don't feel so good. The hell is this? We got another meme, boys. All right, 97 days until the election. We're back in the office. All right, news article. Let's see what this is. All good things don't come to don't have to come to an end. A re-election on the horizon. There it is, boys. Both political parties have just finished their presidential nomination conventions, and the candidates have been chosen. One of them is Daniel Williams, the current president of the United States, which is me. It is a great honor, honor, but also great responsibility, he commented. When I asked how he feels about the election, he added, I feel pretty confident. My team consists of highly skilled, devoted people. There is no chance of losing with such allies. His running mate will be the current vice president. He is the best uh, colleague, but also a remarkable friend, says Daniel Williams. Election day is on the 5th of November. Don't forget to register and vote. All right, boys, we're getting closer and closer to the re-election, the actual elections now. Good. Oh, we still have one more turn for the friends in high places thing. Let's go ahead and open the door up. New stuff, boys. Finally, some new uh, new action. So that was something. How are you feeling at this, uh, as the candidate for the uh, president? President. So sounds familiar. I have already been there. Victorious, I've won, and that's all that counts. Normal. This is just another day at work, really. Right. But wasn't this kind of distressing to have the vice president as your rival? No. Why? He's a great politician. Well, he, he can be the next president in the future. He just has to wait one more turn. Well, we are friends, not rivals. You know what? He's a great politician. I would never doubt it. You make a great team. Mr. President, yet you did much better than him. Thanks to the right decision and previous investments, we have to keep up the good work and, and everything will ju be just fine during the elections. Yeah, I think so too. All right, so let's go. Uh, you deserve the glory. Almost forgot. You have a visitor. Do you remember our conversation about the medical checkup? All right, I guess uh, this doc the doctor is here right now. I guess I guess the doctor is here, boys. We have to, we're about to have the uh, examination. So there he is. The president's doctor. Uh, first of all, let me say this. this. It's an honor to be here. I'm really glad that I, am to, uh, I can be the one to examine the president. Yes, yes. Just proceed as this was the, any other case. Really? Um, yes. So I'm really sure to, uh, sorry to disturb you, but I have to ask you some uh, questions. This is just formality, but a necessary one. Uh, how are you feeling? Actually, a lot of stress and work. Above all, uh, above all, tired. I'm generally in pain. No, I, I'm tired. Mostly tired. So what bothers you most? My whole body is in pain? No. A headache, stomach, and uh, everything ache, I guess. Interesting. Have you experienced any problems with the memory? Have you even work, uh, ever woken up and did not know where you were? Uh, uh, yes. I, uh, why, uh, why am I feeling so bad? No. I guess sometimes. You often feel weak, like you could lose consci consciousness, or have you even f actually fainted? I feel like fa I feel like fainting. Or uh, once or twice, no big deal. Okay, I will say uh, numbers. What would I ask to do is repeat. After one minute, ready. The numbers are 3105075. Oh, fuck. All right. 3105075. This one. That's correct. You see? There's no need to worry. There we go. I got it, boys. I got the right one. 
All right, so we will come back to work and forget about it all. Don't uh, long live denial. All right, there we go. The full results should be available in a few weeks. I will bring uh, them to you personally. It's been wonderful to meet you, Mr. President. My grandson is your fan, actually. Could you give him an autograph? Of course, an autograph, no problem. Politics is going down. I don't. I guess politicians don't like boys, don't like anything in life. I guess politicians are big jackasses or whatever. They're really evil. All right, what is this? Prescription? Oh. Wait, I have a prescription? I can reject it, to be honest. I could reject the prescription. I am gonna... I'm gonna reject. Reject! Afghanistan victory! There it is! We did it, boys! War was long and unforgiving. Troops returned home victorious, although not without losses. Plus 36 of military, boys. Nice! We won... All oh, right, we won our war in Afghanistan. What are, what are you talking about, boys? Do you see that? I'm a great president. We actually won a war. All right, so I just want to inform that we successfully subdued Afghan guerrillas that we were that were threatening our supply. It took us a while, but we managed to limit our losses, both in terms of personal and equipment. We're re, uh, recalling most of our forces right now. Good. That's fantastic. We actually won a war. That's really gonna help me out uh, in terms of uh, of the AI, the society uh, society wise as well. Really gonna help me out, boys. Project-wise, I can't do anything else. So, uh, we're good on that. Traits. Uh, not, not traits. Development. Still working on it. Let's just end the day, boys. 81 days until the election. Old school is the best school. Let's find out what is this. So, obviously, this school went all the way up. The economy went down a little bit for society, boys. But, your economy is doing really great. I'm like the best economist ever, boys. What the hell? All right, so we got a perfect solution for you. Are you all alone in the cold, vast universe, devoid of any god or even meaning? Both your parents are dead, aren't they? Your wife gone, uh, is gone since what feels like forever, and now she enjoys, uh, enjoys her new husband mu much more. You even feel depressed, tired, scared, nervous, or too vulnerable for your own good. We've got a perfect solution. What the hell is this? Total legit not scam. Dot com boys. All right, I guess I'll believe you plain sad various very serious. I'm gonna I'm gonna be serious your email must have been the most wildly specific message I got in here in years. Sure. I was traumatized by mother. Yeah, I'm gonna send that All right, what is this? If your ex wife uh, thinks you're a joke if your parents are dead and it won't help you anymore If you feel depressed tired scared nervous and too vulnerable for your own good all you need is a strong erection. Great. Just one injection of your woodpecker formula will make you a better man. What the hell is this? For just $39.95 a month? Yo, get the fuck out of here with that. That's way too much. Now we're going for firm grasp. Uh, 200 plus 200 military and politics. That would be really great. 50 society and industry. I can get uh, I can get rid of that no problem. I can get rid of that uh, and uh, politics wise or uh, industry right? Is it industry? Yeah, industry. I don't care if it goes down. I'm really good at industry. From grasp, it's gonna take three turns though. That would take three turns. Social safety net, industry will go down, but the society will uh, go up. Let's do that first. Uh, we I don't need industry as much. Let's just go down. It's gonna need to, uh, gonna take one turn, so it's perfect for us boys. So next up, finally, I hope you're doing well. I'm here to talk to you uh, about the campaign. I'm all ears. So I really like to, uh, to still call you president after the election, but we all do our respect. You need to stop alienating, alienating your voter base. What do you mean? What does he mean alienating my fan ba uh, my voter base, boys? What's that mean exactly? You mean I need to actually have society go up right now? I'm glad I've got your full support, boy. What do you mean alienating? My voters love me. What the hell are you talking about? It is love, I agree, but a tough one for sure. And we must always remember what our trouble, when one trouble pop star was singing about. Love is a losing game. I don't know who you're talking about, but whatever. Don't sugarcoat it, Chairman. Just tell me how exactly I'm uh, dis uh, distancing myself from my voters. 
Well, it's about the music, sir. What do you mean, the music? What do you mean by that? I love music. I know, but it's about the type of music that you love the most. Listen, sir, there was a series of articles about Riley playlist and what it says about each candidate. Because I don't like country music, you're gonna tell me the Na uh, people in Nashville are gonna hate me? Well, live on with it then. Who the fuck cares? Like, leave me be. My music is my music. What the fuck is wrong with, uh, with, uh, with liking your own stuff? I've chosen these songs myself. It's fantastic stuff. Yeah. Sir, we all do respect this stuff was fantastic 20 or 30 years ago. Are you calling me old? Are you son of a bitch? We need to reach out to the younger voters. There's a whole new generation of kids who are too young to vote for your four years ago. Look, I am not going to tell young people that I actually like trap music. It's never going to happen. It's garbage music. And pop music is pretty awful as well. So leave me be, alright? I'm not listening to trash ass music. Everybody knows what good music sounds like. And it's not trap, nor pop, nor country. So don't, don't bullshit me. You know damn well you like the same stuff as me. So stop, stop bullshitting me, guy, my guy. I don't think that I don't think I'm gonna like them very much. You know what? Oh, that's oh that went really down. Oh, that actually went down. All right, whatever then. Over my dead body. Okay, so only want uh, I only want to tell you what uh, we could get millions of new voters on birds if you try to choose something a bit more mainstream. Mainstream. What Taylor Swift? Fuck off, man. Get the head out of there with this shit. Over my dead body, I, will I never renounce the music that made me who I am. Exactly. Fuck off with that, man. That's bullshit. You don't have to renounce anything. Just play some fresh and catchy songs on Rally and win the next election. Then you can listen to anything you want. Yo, if you put it that way, then okay. I'll talk to someone who knows what's cool in the modern music. Well, yeah, I guess we'll talk to somebody who's cool and hip. Whatever. Great guess. It's my last chance to appeal to your younger vocals. Maybe I'll even start using social media to tell the whole world what's on my mind. Yeah, maybe I'll start uh, tweeting on Twitter every five seconds. Maybe that's gonna put, uh, make me a cool and hip person, I guess. Serious? Funny? Let me see if you're serious. Music is a beautiful thing. Some songs even bring me uh, bring tears to my eyes. Often I dream about being a rock star, but I can barely play a hair guitar. Uh, outrageous. What is this? I hate modern pop music. It all sounds like a other trash and electronic farts. My heart is so full of music, I bleed sounds. Notes on many occasions. Uh, weird? You know what? I'll be weird about it. Boom. Went up. Diplomacy went down, but you know what? Society went up. What could I mean? Are you a robot or something? All right, our press is so weird for you guys. Is that a metaphor? I'm gonna be metaphoric to stick on that one, boys. I'm gonna be weird and uh, weirding them out a little bit. End the day. How do you do, fellow kids? Okay, 78 days until the election. Uh, so industry went up a little bit, but society went up. Uh, uh, industry went down a little bit, but society went up because of the development strategy I went for, boys. Uh, we only have two turns or three turns stuff now. Closely ties would bring up our politics by 200. Economy would go down. We have a lot of economy right now, which we can afford. We can actually afford to do that now. Uh, we could do that. I mean, this really sounds like a good one, though. Uh, but uh, I think... I think I don't want to hurt too much my society since it looks like I'm going to need it right now for the actual... Let me, yeah, you know what? Diplomacy go up, industry go down. Let's, let's do this one. International Eco Network. We're gonna do that one. Because society needs to go up. I feel like for the elections, I, I feel like that's what the game wants me to do. Let's do... Okay, no, before we answer anybody. Is there any reptilian photos? Do we have the password? We don't have it. Just want to see what's behind those photos, boys. All right, well... Uh, we're gonna end the video right here. We finally managed to get re-elected, well, boys, as the candidate. Now we're actually going for the uh, actual presidency election. The guy was warning me about probably society, so I gotta watch out for those.
probably try and upgrade those a little bit. I did go up big time on uh, economy, diplomacy. We're doing pretty well overall. Uh, but uh, we'll see what I can do for the next video. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy the video. Keep it easy.